I think a lot of viewers have this idea that if you didn't get first place, you're playing badly. I don't know if you were there, but I was playing in a tournament earlier. I was playing in the Dragon Cup and I got second place against Kiyun. And the moment the game was over, everybody in the chat was like, oh my God, Box Box, you're literally trolling. How did you not win that? You could have done this. Why didn't you move your unit to the left? It was crazy. Like I was sitting there like, sheesh, second place, baby. I was so happy. And then I opened my chat and it was just like the most toxic cesspool ever. Chatting. Hello, Gucci ships. I am the rock. Volley bear. Oh, I haven't seen one of these bad boys in a while. Oh, Yuri and Kek. Welcome. Okay, if I get a rotter tier, I'm gonna keep this Tilia. Yes. Uh, I mean, I've got Titans. Down to just start default Jade. Titans Wolf is probably actually a really good early game. Pray for combat training. I don't even need combat training. Give me Prismatic. Give me Scoped Weapons. Do Braum for Scale Scorn Odds. No, you can't manipulate the first augment. No. Can't get that Nasus. Oh, I'm just down for CB. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know exactly what this game is. Pretty sure we are playing for win streak. It's a standard game. CBT! Very standard game here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hello, Moopy. All right, next round, I level up, and then I play the Lee Sin. Dude, this novel AI thing is just so cool. Chatting. What's the Mirage? It's Warlord. Okay, I mean, this is a very standard game. We go, I have Titans, I have CBT. Just look for Siphon to show you. What does CBT mean? Uh, I promise you it means Celestial Blessing 2. Don't Google it, just take my word for it. Would I ever hold pair of Lee Sins? Am I that maniacal? I'd have to sell my Karma pair. Sell Karma pair to hold Lee Sin pair. Oh, I would do anything to hold Lee Sin's pair. No, I, I think I'm actually down. You have now reached 300 flush today. Although I'm 2.5 times as likely to hit Karma than hit Lee Sin. But what if I told you more dog just emailed me and he said, baby, Lee Sin is coming. And so am I. I'll take my Lee Sin too. I'll take my Lee Sin too right here. Fuck. It's fine. Karma pair, Lee Sin pair. I'm sure I'll hit the Karma eventually, and I'm sure that the reason why I lose is not going to be because of Karma 2 diff. Yeah. Oh, this guy... Oh no, you have a Nico! This guy is like prepping to play, um, same build as me. I mean, I remember Asa saying, you should always expect to get contested if you're playing, uh, Shiyu. It's like, it's too good of a build. Because a lot of people see Shiyu as like a, you get one early and you guarantee a top four. And then you can like maybe play for a, like a top two if you're really lucky. But like the fact that you can like get a free top four on like one early unit is really crazy. So yeah, we should just expect to be contested all the time. Do you want to sell these Sinpair to keep Karma? No, I hold both and I hit both. You don't believe me? I'm willing to bet my, I'm willing to bet my box flower poster that I hit Lee Sin next shop. If I don't hit Lisa Nick's shop, I'll throw the flower away.
die. Three, three costs. Oh no. Oh wait, leasing kick here saves me. No, it definitely doesn't save me. Oh, this guy is so strong. No, if only at least in tanked. Wait, hold on. Is my least gonna clutch this? Okay, kick him together, then Karma. Oh, no, not good enough. Okay, there was like a small chance I could win this if I, if my Olaf positioned better. And notice I'm saying Olaf positioned better uh, to avoid all responsibility on myself. I didn't misposition him. Olaf mispositioned himself. I got stupidly strong. This guy has a two-star Karma and two-star Malphite and two-star Skarner at five. Wait, until it, wait, he has five two-stars, what? I have five one-stars. Dude, I have five one-stars. How the f Hello, Adrafen. Box Box, I would've sold Olaf for Lee. Nah, you're out of your mind if you ever think selling Olaf is the right play. This guy is not only my carry, he has also two synergies. I do think I sell for 20 though. I fall too far behind if I don't sell. Actually, you know what? I changed my mind. I know Lee Sin is coming. I refuse to sell. I refuse to sell. I have so many pairs. I have so many pairs, it's not even funny. I'm in a really bad spot. I have 20 gold, all one stars. Okay, I'm playing like this to try to get my Olaf killed. Lee Sin is imprisoned behind Karma's juicy thighs. All right, give me a chain vest. Okay, give me a chain vest or a glove. Okay, that's... Oh, that's really bad. These are like the two worst items I could have gotten. I did it! He's here! He's here, everybody! Okay, I can either rebuild my Olaf, move all items to Lee Sin, or I can just greet it out. I can greet it out for a two-star Olaf. Am I really gonna be that greedy? Yeah, I'm down, I'm down. I can be level 620 gold and win streak. I still have so many pairs. Yeah, I can either capitalize on my Lee Sin 2 spike or I can greed for a, an Olaf 2 spike as well. What I, would you do if I told you Olaf 2 was coming right now? Age of Dragons? No, that's that's not the right one. Uh, it's definitely a reroll here. Oh, fuck. Is it level up? I could also do Warrior, kinda, but like it's not that great. I think it's level up because I haven't spent much money on EXP yet. I think I spent like four, but like I don't have any econ. I mean, I'm down to just take it and then econ up because I don't think Warrior Crown spikes me that hard. Okay, in that case, in the name of saving HP and money, let's do this. I think it's a slam everything here. It's a slam everything on Lee Sin angle. And then just try to let him carry me. But yeah, I think this makes sense. You just like, I have a strong board, so even a prismatic augment down, I can probably still win because I greeted for this Lee Sin too. Just let him carry me. This unit will solo carry. He has so much healing. And then eventually I can uh, either go level nine with dragons or I can go uh, Shiryu Siphon. I think you're not supposed to go Shiryu Siphon at level up. I think you're supposed to just go nine play dragons. And I, I kind of can. These items are not terrible. You'd put the Titans on Terra. You'd put the Hodge on Terra and the Gunblade on Aoshin or Shivana. Um, Level up this thing. Okay, now here's a question. Am I down to sell Nar pair for Eco? Pretty sure the answer is yes. Am I really expecting her to show you?
I mean, this should be good. This should hold out for a while. Hello, work to get. With your life, you could try level 10. I'm pretty sure level 10 is a bait. You know how people say level 9 is like oftentimes a bait? Maybe not this patch because level 9 is really strong. But in general, people say level 9 is a bait. With level up, level 10 is the bait. Oftentimes, you throw the game because like, would you rather roll 60 gold at 9 or like 10 gold at 10? Right, obviously 60 gold at 9. I. What does level 10 get you? Level 10 gets you e even further odds of hitting legendaries, and then it gets you one fawn. I think you would only go level 10 if you could roll, like, 60 gold level 10. But, like, do you really think you can go 60 gold level 10? The lobby must have been garbage to let you do that. For you to go 60 gold level 10, you have to play a prismatic augment down and win streak for a very long time. I feel like it's just not happening. Uh, the other way I could see you going level 10 is to roll down at 9, be strong, and then stabilize, and then go 10. If you hit really early, you get your, like, 2-star out Shin and 4 dragons at 9, then you can chill go 10, and then cap out with, like, a bard. Uh, down for damage item. Sword. Wait, this is funny. I could swap this Olaf because the sword has 10 damage, or I could put in the 8 stack Olaf and try to get him to stack up a little bit more. There's nothing that great I could put in. I think we just chill. I've got like the os the optimal build here. Holy shit. This is like such a good level 6 board. So many synergies, so much power. Hello, Troyo. I'm so glad I greeted that Lee Sin. That Olaf was definitely not strong enough. Oh, dude, my Lee Sin is going to get what is known as a sick kick. Check this out. Boom! What a kick. And it gets Malphite out of the way. Boom! It's kind of like the Karma from earlier. Take damage, kick, heal. Rinse and repeat. Oh yeah, if I get a Fawn, I could go six dragons. That's kind of funny. What the? What the fuck is going on? What? D what? Hello? <laughs> Did I lag? What happened? <coughs> oh, fuck. I don't think I can beat this guy. Unless my Lee Sin sneaks up to the back line somehow. Maybe. I really don't want to lose my streak here, but this guy's really strong. Is there a chance my Lee Sin Oh! Look at my Lee Sin's angle! Oh! One more time! One more time! I can't see his health bar. No! Yes! What a kick! What a kick! What a kick! Oh my god! Game winning kick! He was so low! Alright, leveling up for Aoshinons. Yeah, he should play football. Holy shit. <laughs> that was awesome. I just got so much money for that. What's the shimmer? Mogul mail. Uh, I don't even know what I can play here. From out of the sewers comes doom. Oh yeah, maybe I should just level to 8 for EDOS. That actually does not sound bad. Alright, I probably lose my streak here. You want me really crazy? I think late game specialist would instantly win me the game. Because I would go 9 right here. Actually, late game specialist, I could go 10. No cap. It's a prismatic augment in disguise. Come on, Licking Specialist. Or even just Windfall. 
Uh, it's probably Stan United. I'll have a lot of traits active. Oh, you can only get like him specials on 3 2. Oh, I see. Alright, I don't expect to win, but if I somehow do, I will pog my pants off. I'm playing a Prismatic Augment down. But I do have a lot of uh, Stand United value. Oh, come on, Lee Sin, can you heal back to full? Heal back to full. Eh. That's okay. I'm level 8, 50 gold. Can I really be that upset? Is Rage Blade, Hodge, Gunblade enough AP for Ocean? No. Some of these items are definitely going, going to go on the other dragons. Yeah, some of them are definitely going on the other dragons. That's for sure. I can probably sack all the way to Charge Dragon and then go 9. I have a lot of money to roll. So Gunblade can go on Shivana. Hodge can go on like Terra. Titans can go on Terra. I found out Titans is really bad on Shivana. Write that down. Her Flame Breath, you would think that it does like a thing. You would think that the Flame Breath gives her like the, you know what, like um like one stack per breath tick, but it's actually just like one for the entire thing. So never Titans or Shivana. I learned that the hard way, it was so useless. Oh yeah, baby, kick that statue. This least in two is so efficient, holy crap. I'm so glad we took level up. But yeah, I I don't want to do Gwyn Su's Aoshin. I'm hoping I can do uh, Shoujin. But also I'm thinking like, if I get a tier, it could be Archangels. Is Zippy any good in Dragons? No, but I would play a two-star Zippy while waiting for Terra. Box box, I hit masters for the first time after watching your streams. Hey, let's fucking go, dude. I'm proud of you. Tier, tier rod, tier rod, tier rod. Is all dragons viable? Uh, if you have six dragons, yes. I don't think five dragons is good. The five dragon spike is not very good. 40 health per second, but the six dragon buff is ridiculous. Are you gonna play last chance qualifiers? Uh, I doubt I make it. I'd have to gain like 300 LP very quickly. Yeah, I'd have to gain 300 LP very fast. Okay, I'm down to like, down to int this. Actually. I'm surprised I was able to do this. Okay. Done. I'm surprised I was able to make 40 gold. Level 9, 40. Okay, uh, I'm not gonna slam any items until I see which dragons I hit. It's probably Shoujin, but it, I could see a world where you do Archangel's Giant Slayer. Oh, please give me my mogul money. Nice. What do six dragons do? They become ridiculously OP. Ridiculously OP, it's not even funny. It's just like all dragons get a shit ton of stats. Oh, wow, okay, uh, wow, wow, okay, wow. Um, down to play, this is a small upgrade. Yeah, this is a small upgrade. I'm down to make the Shojin. Down to make the Shojin. I'm like 99% sure that those components are going to be used in that form. Save a little bit of HP. What would you do if you got Fawn? If I got Fawn, I would try to go 10. Yeah, if I got Fawn, I would try to go 10. I doubt I could. Or I doubt I get a Fawn. Yeah, I'd be able to sell my whole board and just play six dragons. No, we can do better than this. Oh, well, that's just straight up insane. All right, roll for the dragons. I'm level nine.
Oh my god, this shop is so expensive. I'm holding so many expensive parries, but I should be fine. My Ashen's build is kind of nuts. Oh, nice, nice. Perfectly killed the backline. Perfect nut. Now we get to live. Zero defensive items. That's fine, we do so much damage. I, I was thinking of ZZ Rot, but I don't think you need to do Hat Hat. I'd rather just cast twice. Do you want Jace over Soraka? Nah, Jace is like a scam. I'm pretty sure Jace is a scam. That's kind of terrifying. Position away from the Shivana. Was there ever a normal death cap Gunblade on Aushin and greater death cap on Shivana? No, I don't think so. I think this is the correct. Uh, the Morales is really important. Wait, what? My whole team is just dead. This Yone double trouble scoped weapons Yone is too fucking fast. What? My Shivana didn't even get to cast! This guy didn't even use his Nikos. Oh my god, he can still get stronger. Okay, well, I need to hit one of these two and then I can sit. Wow, that was Double Trouble, Warrior Crest, Scoped Weapons, Radiant Gwinsu's Long Yone. What the hell? He just slices through my whole team. Oh, uh, I definitely want this, but I'm done as Lock Spirit. Oh fuck, my Terra is not going to be very tanky here. Oh no, this Shuyu is too smart. It's a bait, you need the... Oh, actually, you're right, it is a bait. Who cares about Bard when we instead need to fucking... Yeah, I don't care about Bard too. Yeah, you're right, you're right. I need to hit this upgrade. You know what would actually be good? Soraka Gnar would be really good. That's 5 Jade and Shapeshifter. Oh, Dragon Carousel. Uh, down for Chalice, Aushin. I feel like most people wouldn't take that. Uh, and then I could also do Shivana. Mirage Shivana is kind of funny. Okay, let me get that Chalice, Aushin. That's so huge. Nice, now Chalice just goes on Bard. Nice, I can probably sit now. I can probably sit until maybe level 10. Actually, I'm done to do this. Done to do this. I think it's a little bit better. Long shield you. 14% chance to win. Really? I feel like I'm so strong. I've got Terra too. I feel like it was not even close. How much money for 10? It's quite a lot. A 10 I could play Jace. That Yone guy. I think that Yone guy is unstoppable. I'll never kill him before he can um like one-shot my whole board. <laughs> That's the scary part. I'll never kill him before I can one-shot before he one-shots my whole board. Please don't face the Yone guy. I'm probably playing for second place here. Which is weird, because usually when you level up and you reach your dragon board, usually that means you win. You like play around your prismatic win con, and you win the game. But no, here, this guy just hit harder. <laughs> it's rough. Oh, beautiful Aushin ult. Perfectly animation cancelled the healing. Or the CC. Will the game be over before level 10? I... No, I, I think I can go 10. I think I can like barely reach it and then just play like a one star unit for more synergies. One star Jace just for more HP seems pretty worth. Oh, BT Terra, let's go. That Yone comp is augmented. Yeah, yeah, 
That's why I think Scoped Weapons is the worst augment in the game. Worst designed augment in the game. It just says play Yone or play Olaf and then win if you hit. And then he got double trouble as well, so he wins the game. I mean, it's fine. Prismatic lobbies are usually casinos, and I will be happy to take second here. But, like, it's so good against dragons because AoE is, like, actually not very good against dragons. Yone is all single target damage, which is huge. It's all single target damage. Oh, a Nico. I mean, there's one, there's only one use here. We all know what to do with this. Aushin 3, roll it down. Just using us as buffer to go 10. Oh, oh, Radiant Zephyr, uh-oh. Oh, my Terra, wait. Wait, 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 that's the only way I could lose. My Aushin! Hurry up and cast! Oh, he's barely... Oh my god! Okay, he barely got his cast off. Holy shit. Thank god he got his cast off. I can stay alive. Come on, Terra. Clutch it out. Holy shit, that... Oh my god, that was so close. He was like barely out healing everybody. Holy crap. Yeah, Bard save. All right, ladies and gentlemen, fuck. I mean, I just level here. I, I, I'm pretty sure I lose here. I'm just trying to go opposite side of the Yone. Unless my Aushin one-shots his Yone. I'd have to get really lucky. The perfect knight. The perfect knight! Let's go, dude! Dude, that Zephyr actually fucked him over. It made all of his units surround my Terra, and then my Terra got an ult, which synergized perfectly with the Aushin ult, and then everything died. My Terra got like insane DPS there, that was crazy. Pog, I always hear Pog. I can't believe I actually beat that board. I'm not kidding, like most of the time, I think without that Zephyr, that guy would have just sliced my Terra in half before he could ult, then he would slice my Shivana, then he would slice my Shioyu, and then my Aushin would pitifully try to kill a couple units before dying. But because he Zephyred my fucking Terra, it made him get in the perfect spot. All his units like went in and then Terra just like descended from the heavens, just came down like a holy angel and just stomped everybody. That was crazy.